From the bar to Broadway, new musical comedy, Something Rotten, headlined by Brian Darcy James and Christian Ball, opens tonight at the St. James Theatre. We're here to talk to the stars. So what are you looking forward to seeing on that stage tonight? Oh my gosh, we heard that there's multiple standing ovations like throughout the show. Yeah. So, I, I mean, Christian and Brian are old friends and we're so excited to see They're them. They're American treasures. They are American treasures, yeah. My dear friends, Christian Borrell and Brian Darcy James are both starring in this show and um, I did smash with them. So I'm, I'm just here to cheer them on and, and I know I'm gonna be the loudest laugh in the whole place. Are you ready to hate Shakespeare in the nicest possible way? I've been ready to do that for a long time. I should warn you, they managed to rhyme penis and genius in the first 10 minutes. Oh my god, well that's pretty genius. I love penis. That's a bad rhyme. Penis? That's a heinous rhyme. A heinous rhyme. <laughs> so have you brought tissues because you are going to laugh hysterically tonight and cry with laughter? Between Christian Borrell and Brian James and Brooks Ashmanskis and Brad Oscar, I mean, what are we doing here? There's no chance that this is not going to be funny. I hear it's the funniest show on Broadway. I've already decided that it's hilarious, and I haven't even seen it. I expect to see Brian Darcy James be a genius, uh, because he is, and uh, it's lovely to, to see him in a vehicle that's gonna showcase him, so I can't wait. I'm excited because it's an incredible creative team. Um, it's a musical about musicals for people who love musicals, and um, that's obviously the most fun because it's kind of like we're all in the same club and I'm really looking forward to it. Opening night on Broadway. It's thrilling. It's thrilling. We're all very happy, and it, you know, it's it's a bubbly kind of night. What is better than an opening night on Broadway? I mean, you know, for something that I've always loved and dreamed of. It's the culmination of so much hard work, and and absolutely a big dream come true. This is unique. Yeah, ship in heaven from beginning to end. Yeah, and Casey Nicola, our director, is responsible for that. He's yes. talented. Oh. <laughs> the writing is so good. It's one of those lovely moments in the theater where you get to show up as an actor and you don't have to work too hard. You just say the words that they've written, and there's a lot of that throughout the night. You know, we're having as much fun as I think is the people that come that's to see the show, and that's, I think that's special. Everybody is having a wonderful time making big fools of ourselves and we laugh and we love each other and everybody's so good at what they do. It's actually a bunch of friends, old friends, getting together and putting on a show. Why do you think Something Rotten speaks to people? Um, well, I hope that it's smart appeal to people. You know, I think the writing is really smart. I think it's just a really entertaining night. I think it's a big, splashy production musical, and we haven't seen one like this in a long time. And I'm such a big fan of original material. The cast is populated with some of the most gifted comedic actors on Broadway, I think. And I think what really gets people is that in Act Two, it gets touching. And I think it surprises people. It's good old fashioned frivolous entertainment. That's what we want. We're not changing the world. We've not got some uh, profound message. We're having a lot of laughs, good fun, and it's uh, a good story. And I hope that it touches a few hearts along the way. There's some really amazing part in the show that I uh, that I really think is really beautiful. What do you hope audiences take away with them from something rotten? I just want people to laugh and care, and I think people will do both things. It's a good big old-fashioned Broadway musical, and so I think they can just kind of put their cares away and just really have a good time. And that's, uh, I mean, that's, I think, what, what we're doing.